looking at some footage of this thing self-launching. Oh, nice. Oh, and I hear the signal increase. Wow, I do like the fact that it does relaunch itself. That is uh, super cool and a lot less of a, a struggle, especially if you're here alone. What's up guys, Bobby W6IW in here. Uh, today I'm gonna be experimenting with the kite antenna finally. I've been waiting a long time. I ordered the Soda Beams kite from uh, DX Engineering. It only comes in one color. Uh, I've got a dog stake here to anchor it from reading on their forums. Uh, some of these really cool wire winders I got from Chameleon. 250 feet of 24 gauge silicon covered wire. Uh, it also comes with this Soda Beams uh, light kifting, lifting kit with some, uh, some bungee uh, for your antenna wire. To, to relieve some of the stress on some connectors and so forth. Um, and I got a nine to one onion. I'm gonna, hopefully, if the wind is good enough, I've been waiting several weeks for this, uh, we'll get the, the kite up in the air today. A link to the kite is in the description below. Thanks for watching and enjoy. All right, this is gonna be tricky. I don't know if you can see it here. Uh, about, say, 30 feet or so. Down the line, I got this swivel here. And then, I'm gonna hook it to this shock cord. So on one end, I made a loop. That's gonna hook to this swivel. Okay. So in this black stuff's the elastic shock cord. That's gonna hook to my antenna. So on this end I got another loop. And then I have a swivel on the end of the 133 foot wire. Got this uh, corkscrew dog stake for large dogs to anchor the kite. Lost uh, wind there for a while. This thing's rated at five to 18 miles an hour and it's only been about four to five mile an hour winds. Uh, it's actually probably about seven or eight right now. Picked up a little bit. So what happened is it sat on the ground like you'd imagine, but I just left it laying there. I went to my car and had a little lunch and all of a sudden I turn around and it launched itself back up. So that's uh, I do like that part about it. But I'm thinking I might have too much wire on here and not enough string or just, just not enough wind. I was trying to go big with the 133 feet of wire. Anyhow, I'm gonna try to, to get some contacts before the wind goes away. CQ, CQ Poda. This is Whiskey 6 India, Whiskey November, calling CQ, CQ Poda. Radio, radio, radio. Norway 4, radio, radio, radio. Congratulations, you're the first contact on my kite antenna. I'm using a, a kite with a 133 foot wire, QSL. Yeah, sure, okay, we've got the PRM over top of you. You're about a 333333, three, 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 the Tennessee QSL. All right, thanks for that 33, 33 in the Tennessee. I got you about a 5555 five, five, five here in the northern Nevada. QSL 55 Nevada, good luck with the antenna. Thank you so much, 73. QRZ, parks on the air. Kilo 7, Sierra Echo November. Kilo 7, Sierra Echo November. I got you 5 and 7, 5 and 7. I'm running 133 foot wire with a kite antenna, QSL. <laughs> Very good. Well, you're 5 and 9 in Arizona. I don't know that I've worked a lot of kites. <laughs> yeah, we're doing really, really well. We're 5 and 9 in Arizona. 3 and 2. We're going to go out there. Thank you so much. You have a great day out there. Kilo 7, Sierra Echo November. 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 Kilo 7, Sierra Echo November.
This is uh, whis 7 3. This is Whiskey 6, India Whiskey November. QRZ, parks on the air. November 4, Bravo Delta Whiskey. All right, there is a couple of stations I want to try to get everybody. Let's first go with November 4, Bravo Delta Whiskey. Uh, November 4, Bravo Delta Whiskey. You're really in and out on me. Um, I've got you about a 2 and 3 in the Kentucky. A 2 and 3. Kilo gang. Yourself? I'll take it. Thanks for the 23, 2, 3 in the Kentucky. I got you about a 3, 3 here in northern Nevada. I might be up and down. I'm flying a kite antenna and the wind's uh, kind of dropping on me. Alright, it's time. Headed out quite a bit. USL, my signal to you. 2 and 3 in the Kentucky. Alright, 33, 3, 3, northern Nevada. QSL? Uh, was that a 3 by 3? QSL, QSL. Roger, Roger, 73, thanks for picking me up. 73, you have a great day. QRZ, parks on the air. Whiskey 4, Kilo Lima Yankee. Whiskey 4, Kilo Lima Yankee. Hey, Roger, Roger, are you a 3232 in Atlanta, Georgia? QSL? Thanks for the 3 2 in Atlanta, Georgia. I got you about a 5 and 5, 5 and 5, Northern Nevada. Great, 5 5, you're up to about a 4 3 down. 4 3, over. Alright, yeah, the wind's got a little bit better. I'm, uh, I, I'm flying a kite and I have a 133 foot wire hooked to a 49 to 1 right now. Thanks, uh, it's uh, fading up and down, Robert. Thanks a lot, happy new year. Happy New Year, 7-3. QRZ, parks on the air. Hello, parks on the air. Whiskey, whiskey. Kilo uh, Foxtrot 4, whiskey, whiskey, whiskey. QSL? Kilo Foxtrot 9, whiskey, whiskey. Kilo Fox 9, whiskey, whiskey. KF9WW, over. Okay, uh, Kilo Foxtrot 9, whiskey, 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 WWW. All right, we got you about a 4x4 four four here, 4x4 four four into northern Nevada. Correction on the call, Kilo Fox 9, Kilo Fox 9, whiskey, whiskey, only two, over. Uh, roger, roger, only two whiskeys. We got you, KF9, WW. Roger, roger, you're a 4x8, 4x8. Oh, very nice, the QRP station. That's awesome. Yeah, I'm, I'm doing a kite antenna experiment today. I got a 133 foot wire. I'm flying with a soda beams kite lifting uh, thing, but the winds uh, aren't in my favor today. It's amazing. It's doing the job for you. Thanks for coming to Appreciate it. 7-3, you have a great day. All right, on this end, I got 50 feet of uh, coax with a RF choke and my chameleon 49 to 1. I, I was trying some counterpoise wires to discharge the static. I forgot to bring an earth ground. I feel like that's very important with this antenna, uh, and I didn't bring it, unfortunately. So I was getting a little bit of static. I was able to tune it out, but I know it's not good for your radio. Anyhow, I looped a stress loop there on the antenna so it doesn't pull on the connection over here on this side and then there's a little rope that's connected to the carabiner in a tent peg on this side and then I have 133 feet of wire running up to the kite